Hey there, Cannonites. Welcome back to Halo Cannon. Today we are finally returning to Fleet Battles. Um, I'm very excited to do this for one thing because me and Greg have, uh, me and my buddy Greg who joins before Fleet Battles, have, you know, obviously have fun doing this sort of shit. Always have loved uh, tabletops. But more importantly, you guys have been demanding it. Because, and we, all, of course, also want to show you that we actually do know how to play the game, despite what the comments in the last video said, even though they were technically right at that time, because we did screw up. But now we do know how, even though we haven't been playing for a long time. I think. We have. Shh! You're ruining the illusion! <laughs> but no, yes, we actually have played a, fleet, a few games prior to this, so we are somewhat familiar at this point. Um, and again, I am joined by my buddy Greg. Valum Dominacio on YouTube. Check out his stuff if you love wargaming, especially. Um, I know you've done uh, War Warhammer 40k. Obviously, I think. Do you do War Machine now? I, uh, sometimes. sometimes. Yeah, because I know you play that too. You play that. You've gotten into that recently. Okay, so yeah. So there you go. So at the very least, Warhammer 40k more re more frequently. Also, some War Machine if you're into that, because War Machine's got a brilliant aesthetic. If nothing else, I've never played, so I can't speak beyond how awesome it looks. Anyway. Here we are. We're going to start playing again with Scenario 2, Contact. Or actually, do you want to do, do, you want to do Supreme Leader since you're uh, the Covenant? Oh, sure. <clears throat> Supreme Commander Ro Barutame was silent, awestruck at the trouble of Forerunner relics as Luminary revealed. Oh? Though humans had been ignorant to the Forerunner's gifts hidden in the Beta Iridani system, the fleet of Valiant Prudence was not. Properly plied and fed with power in the phylatery, the recovered artifacts had, had spoken to the ship's luminary, revealing a path to... Whisper, whisper, whisper. What? He did not recognize all of the glyphs before him, but some clearly indi indicated danger, damage, and the marks of the ancient builders. <gasps> An explorer and collector, Supreme Commander Robarutame cared little about humanity, nor knew the full significance of the star system to which he was about, he was about to travel. Nevertheless, he was compelled to eliminate the last enemy forces in Beta Iridani, lest they follow the fleet of Valiant Prudence to their prize. Yeah. So, uh, this time we have six turns to, ba to basically win the day, either by destroying each other, or in Greg's case, his goal is basically as long as he can get as many, any of his, uh, um, get, once he gets his ships across my end of the battlefield here, all his ships, the, um, the game basically ends. Or if I destroy all his ships, or if he destroys all mine. That's basically it. So there's a couple options for the Covenant. I basically just want to try and destroy as much of his shit as I can. Yep. Um, to start, we will roll for... Uh, see who goes first. Whoever's got the most, uh, what is it, command icons. So let's see. One, two, three attack, and two command icons. Or two strike icons. Three strikes, whatever it is. Uh, I, what, which ones? Our attack, yeah. So yeah, attack icon. Yeah, so I got three attack and uh, two, two commands. So. All right, one well, for the covenant. I rolled whoop, two defense, one attack, and two command icons. Woo. Uh, okay. Uh, we could re-roll. Uh, we could either re-roll or we could roll these six to this to determine what do you want to do. Uh. I basically, are you satisfied with your command roll? Or do you want? Let's re-roll, shall we? All right. Rolling again. You want to see two command, two attack, one defense. Covenant. One command, three defense, one attack. Right. At, this, at this time, I am going to activate Robarutame's unique ability, where it allows him to re-roll initiative dice. But I must take the second result. Uh, unfortunately, that ties us up again. So, two command icons, two attack icons, one defense icon. So, again, I get to ask. Re Let's just, just do a d6, d6, d6 this time. To, to move things along. Yeah. Five. Three. All right. There we go. So, not too bad. I got to say, the the whole command icon thing is, diff is definitely a... It, it, it's a mixed bag. Like, so, in my case, it luckily... You know, without his ability, would have gotten me, let me go first. But at the same time, Stanforth's command ability, form up, isn't all that great, especially at this low, at this lower level sort of game. So, but I got to go with what I got. Or, well, it's a it's a poor thing, but you know, being UNSC, it's much better that I get that I move than uh, not. <laughs> True. 
Okay. I will start with my battle with battle group one. Just gonna move eight inches out. And that'll be the that'll be it for the first battle group. Okay. My Covenant's only battle group. And this is right now where I get the Halo Legends music going. <laughs> or even better, ODST is. Now, uh, um, I think it's Mo Monsters and Machines is I think the, is, I think the song. Anyway. Now you'll see here that Greg's uh, smaller feet, his SDC or SDV Corvettes, can actually move further than his uh, C CCS class battle cruiser that uh, supported. The same is actually true of my own marathon, my own marathon class cruiser, and, and uh, the Paris class cruisers. The difference, you know, they can move further if they so wanted. But in my case, I want to keep my group, my battle group, a little closer together mm -hmm. for now, at least. May change as we move forward. <coughs> ah, we lost one, Captain. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> no problem. Note to self, cut it. Or not. Who knows? We'll find out next time on Dragon Ball Z Abridged. Oh, please, no. And actually, I don't remember. Can I move them? Bef it's only before for the smaller ones, right? No, no, no. For uh, turning, you mean, right? Yeah, for turning. You can um, for small ships. They can do a turn before, dur before or after. Before oh, and after. Before and after. That was it. Okay. For a larger craft like the SDV and the Marathon, they do one before or after. That's that was it. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'll turn them, and that'll conclude the first round. All right. So we are on round two now. Turn to what what have you? All right, rolling up our command. Yeah, turn to. We either can or we can keep them. It's up to you. It's entirely up to I'll us. I'll re-roll the whole thing. Me too. Okay, one command and two def or three defense. Ooh, nice, and one attack. All right, rolling for covenant. All right. One command, three defense, one attack. Did I get the same thing you just rolled? Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm using Rob Ruto's unique ability again. Hallelujah. Just to break out the monotony. Well, I guess I broke out the monotony. Three attack, two defense. Not bad. All right. We get to go again first. Yay! Do, do, do. And let's arrange at the moment for the furthest ships. That's twenty three inches. My maximum range. 32 and 20. Okay, so I would be able to hit them. I'm assuming the 32 is the missiles. Actually, uh, no, actually for the heavy mech. Nice. Though my secondary, my missiles for my frigates actually are 24 inches. Strangely enough, same with the sec with the missiles for the marathon. But regardless, for now I'll start by taking, this will be a range, this will be a long range attack. So I believe your firepower range reduced by one to a uh, crushing roll. Yeah, to a crushing roll. Three. So there we go. So no rerolls. Um, dice ten. That's what I'm looking for. So you're uh, shooting at the uh, CC, or not the SDVs. I'm going to see, yeah, the two SDVs in the front. Okay. Oh, that is bad. Um, two, three. That isn't even going to make a dent. Nope. 
and he does not. So. But for my follow up, this will be a long, also be long range. I will do a um, firing solution with my missile batteries. Nice. So I get my point defense and so my defense array. Or did I get my point eight. defense dice? Yep. Eight. One and two and four additionally. So this one will be 12 dice. Cool. Still a crushing roll. Here we go. Two, three, four, that was one, five, six, seven. So I get six dice for my point defense. I'm going to quickly use a fo um, an ability focused attack. Reroll up to two, any element may reroll up to two dice. So I'm just going to reroll two of my fails. And I only get one more. So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, eight now. All right. Two, three, four, five. Fuck. So I won't even, but yeah, it's not even worth it. Nothing happens. Yep, just nothing just happens again. Right. Bounces off the shields. Yep. <laughs> Pretty much. There was that one. Not a complete waste, but worth a try. All right, just All right. slap on your activation token. There we go. You're up. Great. So let's see, 45 degrees. I felt that. <laughs> We're actually just going to do a slight tilt, like a 30 degree. My technical difficulties. <laughs> they also lost one. Captain, we might have a chance. <laughs> no, they're just doing fancy maneuvers in space. Sir, he's just listing lazily to the left. He must be a total genius. <laughs> Whoa, look at that guy. He's listing lazily to the left. That guy knows some maneuvers. This guy's moved back a little further because he moves seven inches. There we go, that's appropriate. Yeah, he's moving seven inches. Oh, piece of joke. I don't know. Well, I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> that's right. why I said it. Yeah, exactly. All right, so I guess I'll just do my counterattack. Right. Going to target the marathon up front or going to do my attacks? Let me see what I got available yeah, first. That's true. <laughs> Okay, the normal range is 10 inches, so I'm 90% sure I'm out. Yeah, 20%. Let's so, see, yeah. do do do, farthest guy. Yeah, I can target. Yep. Same goes for the. Uh, yep. Nope. Nope, you fall short. Oh, too bad. Oh, wait, no, yeah. that was the. Uh, that was just the plasma can arrays. Yeah. The plasma torpedoes are in range. Same, and the plasma lands is obviously in range. 18 inches. So it's long range for everything, but that's okay. It's good for me. <laughs> so, first off, this is what they got first. Okay, so I can do that and that. Okay, so first I'm gonna use the Covenant supported CCS Battle Cruisers Plasma Lance. Which is going to be its own thing because that's yeah. the that's only weapon in the in the entire battle group. So it's using it at long range, obviously. Yeah. Which obviously means do, 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 minus one to the firepower rating. Yep, makes sense. So it becomes a crushing roll. Yep. Sounds good. And I get a total of. All dice. Six. Eleven. Twelve. 
I'm also going to use one of my commander's attack bot dice to use focused attack. I may reroll up the two attack dice. These dice may only be rerolled once. All right. I'm going to use brace, brace, brace. So two, um, whatever the total is, reduce it by two. Whatever the total success is, reduce it by, reduce it by two. Cool. Roll two dice for my command. Hmm, not bad. Reducing it by two for for your commander's ability. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Let's see. That gets to the first damage track. So there goes my uh, my titanium. Armor. Yeah, titanium armor. Right? Or can I defend against the plasma rods? Yeah, titanium, titanium armor is used is is, yeah. your, is your defense network. Yeah, but so. Roll defense for nothing. Well, at least you nothing. Yeah, at least and there goes my titanium armor. <laughs> it was nice to know you had it at least. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I, that could not have gone worse. So slap on a damage token. Yarp. All right, that was just the first barrage. Oh no, that's not a damage token. What am I doing? Yeah. Anyway, so now I'm going to do a firing solution. With everyone's plasma can or plasma torpedoes, I'm sorry. So, okay, four for each of those, five for the CCS. Four, eight, twelve, seventeen dice. Focusing on the marathon again, I assume. Yep, well, in at long range. At least I have my point of that still. So I have seventeen dice. Using another attack die to reroll two of those. Use another defense die to take off two things. Two successes, that's what I was looking for. Hmm, that's a bad roll. Yep. It's not gonna do anything. Well, I could roll two of those dice, so let's roll these two. Nope, still nothing. Yeah, it's not going to do anything. Yeah, out of three, so... Thank goodness! On my part. Yeah. Alright, that's Activate. it for that, for that, for that uh, battle group. Alright. So next battle group. Where the hell do I put it? There you go. You are. Well, this is the fun part, isn't it? Gotta get past an asteroid belt. Guys, <laughs> what's up? All right, do a slight, slight turn. And let's see if I am in range for anything. Twenty. Let's I'm pretty sure you are. Okay. You can't target the back row the elements, but I can try. Oh, I can do a full firing solution. I will lose a little bit because of. On um, one of the roll, I might have to actually do that as a separate roll. I think so. Yeah, so I could do a, I could do a map firing solution with these three. Number four would have to be its own roll because he's firing through the asteroid shield. Yeah. Right. Um, but then okay, so I'll start with that. So for, we'll do three as a firing solution <clears throat> cool. uh, with my small with my light max. Okay. Uh, four dice each for twelve total. Yes. So hold on, I'm getting the right one. The bat, the different uh, formation has different has a different dice for the um, trident formation only gets three for its max. I don't know why, but nice. got my defense array. Okay. Oh, hold on. Mm -hmm. Before, I'm gonna check one thing. Sorry, one thing I forgot to check. Your life. No elusive. <laughs> oh yes. I forgot the paper. Yeah, you're, you're taking additional. You take additional minus one to your firepower rating because you're targeting it at long range. Uh, or just, it is element the elusive loadout cause any attack made by an enemy element against it to suffer a minus one to its firepower okay. rating. 
So that becomes a weakened roll where any successes are only worth one success. So good thing I'm using a fire solution. Yes. Might not even be worth it to go. Yeah, I actually this guy actually couldn't attack you at all because it'd become an impossible roll. Oh gee, yeah, I can see that. Anyway, so. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna use one of my defense icons. Actually, can I use can I use multiple ones or just the same or just only one? Well, what's the rule on that? Like, do you have to do you have to call that before the initial dice roll? You are maybe issued after any initial defense um, dice pool roll. So I have to yeah. first. No, nothing. Okay, but, then yeah. Um, I see no reason why they can't stack. So I'm gonna use both of them to re-roll. Because I can roll each one allows me to re-roll a single defense die. All right, here I go. Re-rolling. One. Well, still some. That's still better than nothing. All right. So, how many so I have eight, so that seven. becomes seven. That goes to the first damage track, but not enough to go to the second. Good enough. I'll take it. All right. And we'll go continue forward with uh, missile batteries. Okay. So that will also be a weakened shot, but you also get a better... Uh, excuse me, chance to defend against that. And then obviously, again, I will not be including this one, so it will be these three, because the other one can't really... So only six dice this time. Okay. And I get three for my point defense. So don't even bother. I oh, got four. Okay. Three. I got oh, three. bother. Wait. All right, well, three. Yep. So it wouldn't matter. Nope. Stupid missiles. Hilarity ensues. All right. That's All the end of that. Definitely re-rolling clan dice this time. Yeah. I got nothing. Likewise. I guess before I forget, on to round three. three. Mm. I will upside down three, but whatever. All right. Three attack, one defense, one command. Three attack, one defense, one command. <laughs> D6 for return. I'm going to re-roll. Only use roll bro to me's ability. Gotta love it. Well, same thing. Literally the same thing. Uh, D6. I figure if it doesn't work, I just roll the back out of the bar. I got a three. Again. You have to go first. Yay, counterattack. <laughs> Quite. Question is, will you finish off the, the... Yeah, it's victory points. Yeah, there you go. And then focus on whatever's left. Yep. My weak little others. <laughs> Alright, so take your first... Ships. Okay. Never fun. Nope. But that's okay. All right. Moving complete. Commencing with attack. Cool. All right. Let's see what we got first off. What isn't? Can, what cannot be initiated for a fire solution? Lousy. Um. Just the plasma lance from the CCS, which is going to be focused on the marathon. It is in short range, so it gets a plus one. Actually, let me double check that. It's an 18 inch minimum range. If it's not, then it fires a long range. Okay, it is in, it is in short range for its plasma lance. I'm gonna quickly use my leader's unique ability to reroll to command dice. Go for Just it. to see if I can get some additional defense. Yes, thank you. One of those didn't matter, but that's fine. Okay. Rolling for a plasma lance, going with 12 attack dice. And this is going to be at a devastating roll. So I get to re-roll a fail and a miss for every exploding result I roll. Yeah. I'm going to use two 
brace, brace, brace. So it'll be your final result will be reduced by four. And I shall roll three attack to allow me to re-roll up to two attack dice. So a total of six. I want that to die in case I it wasn't you obvious. Do. It's my greatest asset. And that's why it worries me. Yep. Okay, so I, I rolled one exploding result. Okay. I'm rolling two, four, I'm rolling the, the six, <laughs> the sixes. Yeah. Wow, this has been a horrible roll. Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, minus four. Minus four. So that's four. Which I do not believe. Yeah, it does not go through the second damage trap, which is six. Don't worry. That's what the plasma, uh, plasma missiles and the cannons are for. Oh, I know. At least I have some kind of defense against that. Some kind being <laughs> the operative words. Yeah. All right. So plasma cannon rays and plasma. Well, the plasma cannon rays are first. You don't have point defense on those. Okay. So that is 10 from the CCS plus three of each for the... The SDDs. That's a total of six, nope, 19. 7, 8, 9, 10, 13, 16, 19. I always sell my attack dice too if it makes you feel any better. Not and much. this is short range. Actually, before I do, Before I do, I think I might have to roll separately for the uh, CCS before I roll. Let me just confirm that before I start rolling. Yeah, okay. In, out, in. So I can acquire two firing solutions. The first is going to be for these two who have a firepower rating of their own, who have a, a uh, yeah. the crushing, or not crushing, devastating. These two will be simply uh, uh, crushing. So, as soon as I get... Is that like a rule with the Covenant? They, it, automatically, it goes up to Devastating? Oh, because Plasma. If I'm in short oh, range, okay. Plasma weapons automatically go um, add plus one to the firepower rating. Hallelujah. So um, I get six... This guy, I think, can you double check if he's shooting through that? I can't... Sure. No, he's not. He's not. Yeah, he is. I can see it like as soon as I was finishing the question. So I get six for the two in the front. <laughs> then I have... The remaining 13, I believe, right? Yeah, that is correct. I have six, totals. seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that's right. Never mind. So I'll roll the one that's for crushing first, which allows no rerolls. Get that out of the way. Two, two four, six, eight exactly. That goes through the second damage track. The ship is on fire. This ship is on fire. Pretty much. All right. Then I have the six in total for the two in the front. This is going to be a devastating roll. I'm going to re-roll any fail or miss results. Which it's so sorely needed. <laughs> and that's four in total. Goodbye. So there's one victory point for the Covenant. And I have, and last but not least, I have the Plasma Torpedoes. This is just to pick off any stragglers. Okay, this one's gonna have to take a firepower rating uh, failure. So this one will negate the uh, plasma torpedo plasma roll, so basically it turns back into an exploding roll. This one's going to be crushing or devastating. The rest are going to be crushing. Cool. Let me just double check the maximum range of twenty four inches. I'm ninety percent sure I'm in. Oh yeah. Well, that's why I check. So uh, I'll do one at a time. Yep. Nine. Uh, oh, there it is. All was well, and that was a defense icon. 
Anyway, uh, so I get four dice for each plant, each each unit or each element. So I get a total of four for the one that's that has the has the exploding roll. Four for devastating, and nine for the crushing. So this, I'll do the, I'll do the crushing first because it's the weakest of the three. Cool. Which uh, I will target this element. All right. Okay, no rerolls allowed. Minus one for my point defense. I have five. Um, that is the trident, so yeah, it does go through the first damage track. Cool. Alright, that was the crushing roll. This is the exploding roll. Allows me to re-roll. Same element, I assume? Same element. I'm just gonna focus far on the same target. Yeah. One, I get to re-roll one miss result for each exploding roll. I don't believe I lose my point defense for the first damage You do not. Right? You yeah. still have it regardless of how many damage points you have. Okay. Two at least, so that's good. Cool. Don't even bother. Pew, pew. And I, then I have the the yeah. devastating roll. Hallelujah. Hmm. One. That's what I needed. I got one of these, so it allows me to roll one of these. This is two minus one, so three in total. That's slow enough to get through the second damage track. All right, this guy's on fire. All right, cause some massive damage. So. Oh yes, that is a that is a apt description of what just happened, and that's it for that. All right, well, <clears throat> move the full. Okay, first. Oh, you have to do your, your entire battle. Oh yeah, yeah, right. I'm sorry. First. Okay, so these guys will target. Screw that. Actually, I'll just move up a little bit. There you go. Uh, You're in. Good. All right. So we're gonna target this guy. Go for it. I want to try and do some real damage. Um. So that'll be a firing solution with my light max total of eight dice. Um. You know what we forgot the full for, um, for, oh no, we don't have any vulnerable tokens. Never mind. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Never mind, sorry, disregard me. I'm not yep. paying attention. All right. Um, I still have elusive, so you get minus one to the firepower rating. Okay, so it goes down to a crushing roll. In that case, I will use my focused attack to allow up to two re-roll, re-roll of two attack dice. Nice. Okay, two, four, six. Nine. So actually, I don't need to reroll because that goes through the seven remaining. Yes, yes, it does. Yeah. So, thank goodness. <laughs> One victory point for the UNSC. Woo! Yes. Fun fact: I lost this when we when we did our last one. So, <laughs> I am gonna be. I would be very excited if I got a UNSC victory on this time <laughs> this time around. Um, and not one for running away like the very first scenario, <laughs> which I don't count. <laughs> anyway, um, let's see, 12, am I in 12? Hey, I'm in 12 inches. So I'm going to do missile batteries on this guy. Okay. Um, obviously, you got your point defense for that one. And elusive. Yep. So again, I will use focused attack. Um, so it's still just a crushing roll. This. Ooh. Don't even bother. Anyway, um, five total. Uh, minus two is three. So it's uh, not enough to get to yep. the first damage track. Unfortunate. Quite unfortunate. So I say in my voiced Kennedy impersonation. Well, let's do these individually. And then I can figure it out. Okay, 
guess that guy's just going to be out of the picture for a while. All right. Okay. What can I target? That would be long. I don't remember what the full rotation is. 45 degrees. I just don't remember how far he rotated. I think uh, you went far enough, I think. Yeah, between the two. Mm -hmm. um, so. Okay, so that would be that. That. I mean, that's in range, so that's a little my. <clears throat> so he'll be separate. Okay, so we'll go with these two to start with a light mech. Um, Firing solution. Firing solution on him, okay. which is eight dice tool. Okay. Again, my six and eight. Uh, defense array. And elusive for minus one on the. They had a defense array against the Mac? Yeah. It's not It's not point defense, it's, it's defense array. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. It's like titanium armor for Covenant. All right, cool. So that becomes a crushing roll. Oh my god. Bad roll? Very bad, so. Mm, that's all good. Okay. Yeah. Let's move on to missile batteries. Okay. Four dice this time. I only get three for point defense. Jesus Christ. All right, right fuck it. I'll use my last one. Fuck it. Worth the <laughs> shot, man. Fuck. All right. Because I don't really have much of a choice, I have to target the CCS here. All right. Go for it. Surprised that's only four for the first damage track. What are you talking about? Is it? Or am I oh, misreading, eight, dude? Oh, you have the wrong. I do. Oh, chase. Oh well. I was gonna. Say, yeah, that makes a lot. Okay, so it's eight. So yeah, it's, I know. it's eight and supported. All right. <sighs> wow. <laughs> I didn't even need to roll, did I? No. Oh, How so unfortunate. All right, well, that's it. Next round. Next round. Time to roll those command dice. <clears throat> Three defense. I'm sorry, what? Three defense, two attack. Cool. One command, three attack, one defense. All right. I will take it. It's got this guy here. He's like, finish me. That's fine. <laughs> All right. So. Yeah. Front. Let's move this guy up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Shift them around, and I'll do something in a minute. There we go. That way I can avoid the asteroids. All right. So, time to attack. I'm going to start by attacking the, 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 the Specialist Squadron. Okay. Starting with the Covenant Support CCS Battle Cruiser. Starting with the Plasma Lance. All right. Uh, which... Targeting ones. the one closest to it. Okay. Just make sure. Sorry, I'm so used to 40k rules where I have to target the closest enemy unit. Yeah, so that's, that's, that's fine. That's why I never fine. see anything. Yeah, and that one's force a habit. Okay, so that's... Okay, so, that, so I get 12 dice. I'm using my one attack die to allow me to re-roll up the two attack dice. Alright. I will use one defense die to take off two from your final result. Okay. Which I desperately need, it would seem. Nice. Quite desperately. So I have to reroll three dice because of the exploding results. Or exploding rolls. Okay. And I have to reroll one more because of the attack die. Which is nothing. Okay. So a minus three from your final result. Two, four, six. Uh, let's see what's arrowhead, so that gets for through the first two damage tracks. 
not all that unsurprising for a CCS class battle. And that was just his primary weapon. Yep. Now, we have the plasma can arrays. Alright, so. Uh, plasma can arrays and plasma torpedoes. You get your point defense against the... I'll roll the, the, the for the torpedo. Knife doesn't really matter if you're rolling for defense in general. Well, I don't think I get it against the You can, don't get it against the can, so I'll roll those separately. Six, ten. Then you get uh, your point defense against the plasma torpedoes. If you live that long. I was going to say, yeah, don't, don't waste them on... <laughs> Well, you never know. Sometimes you need that extra bit. As is the case. Oh, and this is also plasma, so I get to... Uh... I know. Yeah. Okay. So first, I'm going to use it. Mm, don't it. bother. Really? I'm not using a defense thing. I don't have a defense against it. So you're done. That's it. That's that's no, all I'm... you need. It's no, a trick. It's the No! I got God already. damn it! Stop it! <laughs> no. <laughs> that's it. That's it. We're done! We're done. Everyone out. End, 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 end it. End it. Yeah. I just rolled a total of 10. Just for no reason. <laughs> you were basically shooting up the little bits of metal that made it, that made up the space. That was me. revenge for my for taking out my STVs. And just practical to make sure you have a clear path when getting away. Yep. We'll do it live. We'll do it live. Speaking, Pretty much. Speaking of. So um, that's what I like. Before I finish the uh, CCS oh. with the, the torpedoes... I'm going to have the STVs do their plasma can arrays against this guy. Right. Acquiring a firing solution, of course. Okay. Yep, they're in, definitely in minimum range. Let me just double check the one in the back. Hit me with your best shot. Considering you have like Fire three away. in your... Uh, don't. Don't. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> Considering you have like three in your last, defen your last dam uh, damage track, I'm pretty right. confident I got this. These are plasma can arrays, so... Oh, I know. So six oh. dice going out. Yeah. Rolling another attack die for we're rolling two of those for reasons. All right. Oh, I uh, used a sorry a, a shield to uh, reduce it by two. Cool. I don't do anything. Okay. But you know. Uh, and these are the plasma cannons, right? Or yeah, plasma, plasma cannon ones. arrays. Yeah. And that did not do anything. I only rolled two. Yay! <laughs> My ship is on fire. All the air, all the decks are leaky or venting atmosphere, but it is hanging on by a thread. And so. missile batteries, hot <laughs> torpedoes, whatever. At least I have a defense against that. But you waste all your almost all your defense time. Almost being the key word. Yeah, that's true. Eight for that plus five for the CCS. <laughs> And who's right. my last command? I'm using, it. I'm using my last command to kind of roll, roll two of those. So I want to hear who's dressing up as what for Halloween. I am dressing up as a lonely guy who lives in his apartment and doesn't go out. <laughs> so I'm already a costume. That made me genuinely sad for a minute. <laughs> Come on, man. <sighs> well, at least two. Spent some so of those YouTube four. bucks on a uh, hundred dollar costume. I just spent my YouTube bucks on Battlefield 1 and Infinite Warfare. I still need to pre-order that. Well, Infinite Warfare and Modern Warfare. My plan is I'm going to, on November 4th, I've already requested it off from work, I'm going to stream it with the title um, Halo the in the Interplanetary Wars. So I get that's basically what for that. So I, What's this, the stream channel? I, I, don't, um, I, don't I, just I just stream it on my regular YouTube. Oh. I used okay, to do Twitch. On there. Yeah. This is for the command icon. Oh, no, wait. I didn't roll for the command icon. These are not for the exploding results. You already won, by the way. I know. I just want you to know that. I'm aware. I want you to know once. Okay. Minus four. Yeah, it's so dead. <laughs> once again, yeah, you do. by the way, you're three victory points. Yes, yes, that's you true. Okay. Um, by the Don't! way, it follows on my policy. If you hit me, I hit you twice as hard. <laughs> All right. Excuse me for trying to survive and protect my colonies. You, got, you happen to be in the way. It's your own damn fault. Get out the way. <laughs> so if he, if he survives mean, the initial assault, the collateral kills him is what you're saying? No, he's just in the way. I kill him. Oh, well, <laughs> stop being in the way and getting killed. Or be in the way and not get killed. That's preferable. You get a picture it's of It's your the, turn. Uh, sir. I just finished uh, my firing solutions and everything. Where did I click that? Oh, a container of yep. cookies edited into a space background. Okay, so... So just, uh, I just finished my activation. Yep. I am going to. Yeah, I believe it's true. I believe it's true. So I believe it's true. Kick ass, kick names, hopefully. Cooper uh, did not hit the mark on that movie. What? 
I did not care for 2001 Space Odyssey. Yeah, like okay, excuse me a moment while we go kill this guy. Sorry. I, I, I tried. I secretly haven't been able to get through it. I have tr- Thank I got, you. I got Thank this. Thank you. I have tried. I have tried twice. First time, I was very tired, so I kind of like passed through it. Oh yeah, you it. have to be fully aware to get through it. The, the next time, I watched it completely sober, completely awake. With like three energy drinks, I I sat through it and I collected all of the nuance and everything. And I was just like, "Why is this critically acclaimed?" <laughs> There's actually a good number number of good reasons. But it's artistic. We'll, it's we'll, artistically pleasing. We will yeah, talk about just, this later because I have to kill the fuck out of that. Wow, I just realized we went on a whole different segue here. Oh okay. god, yes. Okay, so Do it. Now, now we're watching a, Get me. a baby child pull a blanket because palate cleanser. <laughs> Okay. These guys didn't turn hey, afterwards. We'll just they make the world go around. Bit. There you go. So I can focus on this guy. Go for it. I, I don't, I I don't think I'm going to be able to take out the CCS. I am confident you probably could. Yeah, yeah. fuck it. You know what? If I don't oh, take that out, I'm, I'm fucked anyway. Really? I am going to murder you. I'm going to murder you. So- At least put it on vibrate. You know I have a room full of swords, right? You know I have a strong will to survive, right? And I have a pistol! Yeah, but I have swords with edges that, ble- that cause bleeding. bleeding. I suppose you could take out the nerf things and make use the butt end. There you go. And, or you could use the Master Chief. That's too valuable. Master Chief. Not really, it's like 80 bucks. Shut up, you. <laughs> Anyway, okay, um, so I am doing a full firing solution on the CCS class battle cruiser. Have fun. Which will be 12 dice in total. Have fun. Plus, I am going to use focused attack. All right. Um, we roll up to two attack dice. And then I this shall, is a crushing roll. And I shall put power to the defenses. Which is allows me to re roll a single defense array die. I'm definitely going to need that shit. Come on, twos. Oh, well, at least they're useful. True. All right. Four, six, eight, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen? Okay, cool. Which could probably get the fruit. Two, three, four, we're rolling one for power to the defenses. Five. So ten. So it gets to the first def- attack. Or, yep, the first uh, damage yeah. track. Yep, damage track. Okay, second thing, I'm going to use my missile batteries. Okay, get my point of defense. Six dice. Two, five, and I'll use my last um, focused attack to reroll these two. Which is useless. Minus three is two. Nothing happens. Yeah. That wouldn't have done anything anyway. Oh, well. All right. Should have probably saved that for this guy. Let's move forward a little bit. And actually, I'd have to focus on the CDs. Yep. As otherwise, I'm shooting through. Okay. I'll start with the... I'll start with the... Uh, Mac? Yeah, the Mac. Unfortunately, it's only three dice because of my... Stupid trident formation. And you minus one of the firepower ring because of elusive. Only two, so not. Okay. Missile batteries. Okay, good defense. Nothing. Oh. Don't oh. worry about it. That was disappointing. Yes. Yes, it was. <laughs> hey, you caused a point of damage. I'll give you that much. Shut up. Hey, I'm giving you credit, man. Shut Come up, on. Wesley. I'm not Wesley. Okay. <laughs> Shut up, Wesley. Yep. Uh, I think with? that's turn five now. Um, your turn. Or no. No, it's the next, yeah, the next, next round. Turn. Uh, take, your, take your activation token. Thank you, yes. You're welcome. Uh, this time I really gotta hope I get to go first, because that's my only hope. Three attack, one defense, one command. Two command, two attack, one defense. I will take it. Okay. Or I haven't decided yet. I will re-roll two dice. Exact <laughs> same results. Alright, you're up. Well, I can't really move very far, so... Fuck the movement. Alright, 
I'll start with the CCS because he has the only weapons that can uh, that, that doesn't need that can't do a firing solution. Starting with the plasma lance, going against twelve dice four eight. Here I go. Oh, and this is the plasma roll, or the, uh, the t devastating roll, allows me to reroll fails and one not for each exploding result I roll, which I rolled two so far. Okay, and I'm going to use my commander's ability to reroll two more. Yeah. Or, yeah, that's right. Yeah, probably for the best. Minus one. Two, four, five, six, seven. Gets through the first two damage tracks. Okay. That was the lance. Now we're doing. I'll have the CCS do the plasma can arrays for ten dice. <clears throat> what was it? Just wanted to make sure it was in. Start the timer. Again, uh, devastating roll. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now I'm going to have all three acquire a firing solution with their plasma torpedoes against this guy. So it's four, eight. Fun fact if he destroys my one more element, you will win by default. Six. Nine. That's not fun. That's depressing. Shut up. Thirteen. You get your point defense against this one. Or yeah, you get your point. Yeah. These are plasma torpedoes. Right. Nada. Okay. Plasma. So we'll use this. Devastating roll. Again, plasma. Because shenanigans. Plus plasma. One, two, so I got three exploding rolls, three dice. No, it didn't matter really. Minus two, you said? Yep. Okay. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah. eleven. Oh, yeah, that's uh that's beyond gone. <clears throat> and that is it. With two more victory points under my belt. It is highly unlikely that I would be able to uh recover <clears throat> from this. Slightly, but I just gotta check something. I might. Put jackets there. Actually, it wouldn't matter. So we're beyond that point. Theoretically, I could actually bring these two together as a new battle group. Oh yeah, the ad hoc group, right? Yeah, but um, it, it has to be done during the executive order step, which is at the beginning. Yeah. Shit. So. Which would mean it was the last round, so you wouldn't be able to do anything anyway. Yeah, exactly. So, at this point, I'm going to have to surrender because there is literally no way I can win, for, win at this point. Because I would, the, at best, if I wanted to even tie with you, I would have to destroy all your, your elements. All your remaining elements. Mm -hmm. Which is, unfortunately, impossible at this point. Wow. Well, you, you put up a good fight, but, my friend. Yeah. Hey, that's what the UNSC does. We lose. <laughs> but you lose gracefully at this point. Oh, yes. Right. So, the Covenant has won... They have, have retreated, or they have left the Beta Eridani system, and they are on their way to Epsilon Eridani Reach, where they will find artifacts and stuff. Lovely goodies. Lovely, lovely goodies. Oh, give the Covenant their prize. Tell them what he's won! Space, Space cookies! cookies! <laughs> Space cookies! Space cookies brought to you by SpaceNex. SpaceNex, we will... And we actually don't know what we do. We just we just know we make space cookies. And for the glory of our coming overlords. Of course. <laughs> uh, but no. Yes. So, coming yeah. to one space cookies. UNSC is put in the corner. That's pretty much how it goes. Put in the corner. Put in the corner. Put in the corner. 
<laughs> uh, we're just gonna cut that one out. <laughs> no, I'm not. I, I love me. I love me that kind of shit. Putis. Anyway, Putis I hope you guys enjoyed this sec- this second scenario. I know we had fun playing. Um, we're gonna try and get more of these out more frequently, just so because for one thing, it's it's fun to do, but also I want to get through them and I want to move on to ground command because I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, Greg here has painted all his figures. So I might actually do a showcase on that at some point, just so because I know a lot of you want to see what those look like painted. Um, but yeah, so that'll be that. So Greg, thank you again for joining me. Anytime. Uh, be sure to check out his channel, Valent Dominacio. Link is on the screen right now. It will also be in the description box if you like wargaming. Check him out. 40K, a little bit of War Machine. I'm sure he does some other stuff here and there. Um, Actually, I know he does. I don't remember what it is off the top of my head, but there's some really good videos on there that if you like wargaming, you will absolutely love. Uh, thank you, people in the background, for being assholes. Yeah, boy. Notably this asshole. I, I, I didn't know you were recording. <laughs> oh, yes. You're not on the screen. I record though. everything. You're not on Bunsen. You record everything, huh? Yes. So I shouldn't be using your bathroom from now on. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Okay. Well, I mean, it depends on your point of view. Hee, hee, hee. Anyway, well, I mean, as long as I'm getting a cut of the proceeds, I'm all for it. Who said anything about proceeds? It's all for me. Space cookies! Space cookies! That is how I lost all my subscribers. <laughs> Thank you all for joining me tonight. This has been Halo Cannon, and I will see you next time on Dragon Ball Z. God damn it. <laughs> no. Copyright infringement because you nope. are assholes. Nope. He's a cut off. Bye bye! Bye! Sweet free stuff. Sweet free stuff. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribing, and sharing it around. You are the reason I get to keep doing this, so thank you, profusely thank you. If you want to dive deeper into Halo's lore, head over to the Halo Archive. It's a lore-based community that welcomes everyone from experts to rookies. No matter what your working knowledge, you'll be sure to find a friend and a good time.